this is the crown in handicap at Ascot. We're over two miles, two furlongs, and it's been 0 to 80. Fiddler's Adage for Gray, 7 to 4 favourite. Granite for James Shea. Anger do Hirosimo for D. Thompson. Lucky Rebecca for Martin Leedham. Divine Prospect for Alex Cherry. And Bashasha for T. Rogers. Only six go to post for this. Over the marathon trip here at Ascot. And they're off. Divine Prospect looks to take the early running. Bashasha has been ridden along to take it up now. On the rail, we've got Angra do Hirosimo. As they start to steady down, it's Bashasha from Angra do Hirosimo. Divine Prospect being held onto a bit now. Lucky Rebecca on the outside for Martin Leadham. Granite in between them with Fiddler's Adges just last. As they come up to the stands, um, a lot of these will be probably looking at something like the Ascot Stakes in a few weeks' time. But it is Bashasha who has the lead from Angra do Hirosimo. Lucky Rebecca is in third. Divine Prospect in fourth. Granite fifth. And Fiddler's Adage is at the back. Looks like Covid has had a toll on Ascot. We're racing behind closed doors here. As Bashasha goes past the empty stands. And Bashasha takes them out into the Berkshire countryside. It's Bashasha from Angra do Hirosimo. Lucky Rebecca in third, Divine Prospect in fourth, Granite in fifth, Fiddler's Adage in sixth. One mile four left to go. We're only about six furlongs in here. And it's Bashasha who's travelling nicely for T. Rogers out in front. And Guido Hirosimo is on her quarters. Lucky Rebecca is in third. Divine Prospect 4th, Granite in 5th and Fiddler's Adage still in 6th. No change as they hit the 10 furlong mark. The only change is Granite is now disputing with Divine Prospect for 4th. As they pooed along down towards Swindley Bottom, it is Bashasha still in front. And Bashasha holds off Angra do Hirosimo for the time being. Lucky Rebecca giving them the three lengths, probably about three lengths currently at the moment. Granite, uh, Divine Prospect and Fiddler's Adage at the back. Divine Prospect has started to move up to challenge Lucky Rebecca for third. But it is still Bashasha. Bashasha from Angra do Hirosimo. Uh, Lucky Rebecca, Divine Prospect on the rail. Granite in fifth and Fiddler's Adage in sixth. As they're in Swindley Bottom now, it's Bashasha who's being ridden along to try and raise the pace of this race and is about a length clear of Angra del Horosmo now. We have six rounds left to go. Nothing really making ground from the back as of yet, but we've got a long, long way to go. Bashasha by about a length and a half now. And the T. Rogers horse is starting to try and push the limits of the rest of them and try and sneakily get away from the front. About too clear of Angra del Horosimo now and now the chasing pack are coming with a half a mile left to go. It's Divine Prospect who's making the best route home but Lucky Rebecca is also and they've surrounded Angra del Horosimo and have their sights set on the leader Bashasha. Bashasha is at the free pole and the rest are queuing up in behind to try and get to her. Bashasha is leading by about two lengths from Divine Prospect. Lucky Rebecca granite down the outside. Fiddler's Adage is staying on. Angra do Hirosimo is the only one beat. Bashasha is piling on the pressure up the Ascot Hill. And Bashasha is leading. And Lucky Rebecca. Also Granite, Fiddler's Adage, the three are chasing down the leader. Bashasha is in front, but it's Lucky Rebecca for Martin Leadham, who is making the best of her way home and about a length clear now from Fiddler's Adage. It's Lucky Rebecca for Martin Leadham. Is your favourite commentary going to get one? Yes. Yes, he is. Lucky Rebecca for Martin Leadham. I think that's him off the mark. He'll be happy with that. Lucky Rebecca holds on here in the crown in handicap. The 9-4 to four favourite. She went off and she duly obliged. Lucky Rebecca for Martin Leadham. Wins but from uh, Fiddler's Adage by three quarters of a length. Um, Granite in third for James Shea. And Bashasha held on for fourth for T. Rogers.